something that another YouTuber said that I really resonated with is like, when you stop recording and you stop editing, it, it like grows into this big boulder and the bigger the the longer the break the bigger the boulder and the harder it is to push it to get it rolling again um and i just have to get it rolling again um let's see let's like just recap some of the things from the last few weeks uh since november i participated in a Fortnite tournament uh if you head over to my instagram uh you can see that i posted some pictures from like the last six months or the last five months as a pediatric psychologist uh so you can see those uh i participated in a Fortnite competition well not even really a competition just a Fortnite event with uh some of my patients which was really really fun uh what else happened in November? I went to a Friendsgiving. I didn't go home for Thanksgiving, but I did go to like Thanksgiving with the neurology residents and fellows uh, here at my profession where I work uh, because I have a really good friend that uh, I grew, not I grew up with, goodness, a really good friend that I went to Hampton with. Her and her husband both went to Hampton. They live here. And so I spend a lot of time uh, with them. I wouldn't say a lot of time. I spend time with them, mostly on the weekends because during the weekday, I, I just can't socialize anymore because I feel like a big part of my job is socializing. Um, what else has happened? Uh, men continue to disappoint me, period. Uh, we'll just leave that sentence at that. Uh, I got really, really sick. I had a severe allergic reaction to something. Still not 100% sure what. And then that rolled into like a little bit of a cold, but then the cold went away. I went home for my birthday. Uh, obviously y'all have seen uh, my birthday party recap, but uh, I went home for my birthday and got sicker. Uh, wasn't COVID surprisingly, um, although I'm not 100% sure I believe my COVID test. Uh, I think that it was a little some sum of COVID. Um, what else happened? Uh, I have been playing a lot of Fortnite since that Fortnite event at work. Um, I have been streaming so, 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 so consistently. No, okay, that, that, that made it seem like I'm only streaming over on Twitch and that's not the case. Um, but I have been streaming consistently. I gained like, in the last like six months, so starting in August, I was like streaming every weekend. I'm probably gonna stream uh, this weekend, depending on when this video comes out. My foot's asleep, hang on. Oh, depending on when this video comes out. But uh, I stream on the weekend. Sometimes I stream on Tanisha Tuesdays. Um, and it has been a joy. Uh, I really like streaming because I don't have to edit anything, which is great. But the cool thing is if you miss a stream uh, i have another youtube channel where you can watch all the vods uh from the streams of past of old i think there are like 37 i have no idea i totally made that number up there are a lot of streams that i have streamed and recorded and uploaded to a youtube account that youtube account is here uh you can totally go check it out if you want to check out my streams uh yeah and so it's december 14th i'm probably going to stream uh this weekend and maybe uh tanisha tuesday but then after that i won't stream uh obviously until the new year until i get back to my streaming setup um what else has happened uh my dog got sick at one point that was really stressful um i have been navigating the loss of my first patient um and and just living in a palliative care space, which I've never done before. And uh, it, it has been really hard. I, mm, I say it's been hard, but it's just been heavy on my heart. And I made a whole video talking about like just how hard this has been. And I don't know if I'll release it or not, but that also has been happening. I've just been like, gosh, going through some growing pains, going through just like trying to figure out like, now that I'm 30, what do I want 30 year old Tanisha to be like? And figuring out, you know, what are my New Year's resolutions for this next year, this next decade, um, has been really, really weighing on me. I want to make better decisions and I want to be treated better. And I think the way to be treated better is that I have to start uh, standing on business and start cussing people out. No, I'm joking. I mean, not about standing on business, about cussing people out. I do think that uh, I allow people to 
do a lot in my life that I don't necessarily agree with and sometimes hurts me and I want to I want to do better on that and better with only keeping around people who want to be around and only being around people who like actually want to be with me instead of like feeling like I'm just being tolerated in some in some friendships. So that's I think that's the biggest thing that I'm taking into 30. Um, I'm hoping to be more consistent. My word of the year last year was consistency for 2023 and uh, about halfway through we forgot about that. So we're gonna try again. Um, I really want to be able to balance all the things. Like I really want to continue YouTube and figure out what's next for this channel. I wanna continue streaming on Twitch. I wanna maybe go back to posting on my Instagram consistently. Um, maybe hiring somebody to run my Instagram because let me tell you I'm over it um, I want to like there's just so many things I want to do and experience and try and um, Yeah, so I think you know, I feel like my 20s I spent all but One year of it actually that's not even true. I spent all of my 20s in school um, the last 10 years so undergrad I did a year of an online master's program my post back year my five years of grad school and now we're here uh, and I spent a lot of time in my 20s flailing around for like flailing around because I'm just a people pleaser to be honest and I think I'm at a point where I've learned that people pleasing isn't necessarily going to make people want to stay around and uh, if people don't want to be around that's their business uh, yeah I, I don't know how we got into that conversation but here we are um, so there's just so much I want to do and I want to try and I'm, I'm gonna hopefully put on the channel but like uh, some reading content uh, that I've recorded and just there's just so much that I want to do and also while like doing all of that I also want to honor being freaking still and like just existing sometimes because I feel like I've done a lot of moving and shaking in my 20s and sometimes I just need to sit down and be still and stop talking and just exist sometimes and rest. I'm not good at resting and I, I really want to learn that skill uh, in my 20s. I mean in my 30s, good gracious. Um, so yeah, thanks for hanging in there. Uh, I know this year has been kind of weird but uh, we're gonna try our best for next year to do better, uh, to be better in all aspects, including being better towards myself, not just being better towards other people, uh, which is, I think, going to be a huge, huge, huge growth area for me. Um, but we're gonna try and we're gonna uh, continue to stand on some business. Um, oh, <laughs> yeah, my dog is looking at me crazy, but uh, you know, oop, Naughty hit the camera. Thanks for hanging in there with me and uh, I will see you all in the next video. Hopefully real, real soon. Not in three weeks, not in a month, not next year, but real, real soon. I uh, love you. If you've watched this far, leave a black emoji and I will see you all in the next one. Peace out. Love you all so much. Also check out my other social media and I will see you guys next time. Hopefully next week. Bye. Bye.